What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to EU4 as France. Uh, I was going to say that always always say it's going well at the start of episodes, you know, just to brighten up the mood. But I've realised we've not really done anything yet, so I don't know. It's probably not. It's not going badly, but it's not. You know, we've not done anything yet, so it's not going well either. Um, but hopefully, it goes fine. We are sort of ready to attack Brittany very soon. Oh, they got a new ally. Luckily, I think they're just a one province minor. I'm just waiting, hopefully, for Aragon to peace out Naples and be willing to join in. I'm not sure they'll be too keen, but we can hope. We can hope. Come on. We've got to be getting close to this. Are you not? How are you not doing this? Uh, who's these other guys that joined in? I'm trying to see. I can't even see them. Oh, Saluzo. Okay, these. Okay, well, they're fine. We can deal with them. That's not an issue. Hurry up, Aragon. Get this done. We actually lost one of our generals. We had to wait that long. Are you serious? <laughs> right, no leader. Hire a general. There we go. In you go. Job done. Or just don't show up. There you are. <laughs> Low crown land. Okay. Apparently that's fine at the moment. Um, I guess we'll have to try and get some. I guess if I conquer new land, that goes to me instead of the estate. So that might be where it gets fixed. I have no idea. But that would make some sense, I guess. <laughs> Just a guess. No idea, really. Right, Castile is in a war with who? Granada. If Morocco is in this, I'm just going to go for it. Yeah, look, they're fighting all of that. We can go for this, right. Who cares about waiting? Take Nantes. Confirm. Boom. Here we go. In we go. Into Brittany. I'll go and deal with everyone else afterwards. But yeah, this should be fairly easy. Oh, the Tusk... Mercenary company is now available. I have no idea what that is. Is that a new way of using mercenaries? Oh yeah, it is. Look, there is different. That's pretty cool. They're all different ones. It's pretty cool. Um, fair enough. I guess you hire them as like an army now, as opposed to an individual sort of troops. But there we go. That's a that was a pretty flying start. We made it in Castile. You just really gonna ball in here, or is that? Oh, that's not Castile. S similar flag, but it's not Castile. Aragon's up here. That must be for separate reasons, I would assume. But yeah, this should be pretty easy. Castile's obviously occupied down here, which gives us a bit of a head start. Aragon is... Wait, is Aragon in this? I'm sorry, that is not Aragon. It's a very... Oh, again, the flags. We have one with a very similar flag to Castile. One with a similar flag to Aragon. They didn't think this through, okay? They should have used a less... Less, um... Conflicting flag. Right, there we go, we win the Battle of Armour. Minus 7%, come on, we can do this. I want to try and get it done before Castile. Oh, they've disappeared, see, this is this is where it gets a bit nerve-wracking, because they are... I did see that 27 stack, I don't really want to fight that by myself. Um, or, you know, get caught out while they're not stood together. More importantly, yeah, we should be good, we should be okay. 37 to 28, 10 to 10, 0 to 0, yes, we got a little bit of a numbers advantage. Not see yeah, if we get rid of Brittany, I mean it is against Brittany, but yeah, if we could quickly go go get rid of these guys afterwards, separate piece them, and then yeah, we should be fine to keep keep them away. And they don't actually have enough troops to even siege us out, so we're safe. All is well. Once we get this fort, that'll be nice. This is the capital, it's on fire, it's the war goal as well, so yeah, quite a big victory ahead of us. Do we have no boats? We do. I just don't know where they are. Oh, they're over this side. That's probably for the best. Aragon Royal Marriage, yes. Come on, 42%. You can get this done. You can do it. You've got this, guys. Come on. I feel bad. Ugh, it's been a while since I've had to be nervous about wars. In Austria, everything I touched, like, turned to gold and went well. Even wars with the Ottomans. I don't. I think we lost once or twice, but it wasn't like a mega defeat. It was one province or something, and we got it back by the end, so... It's kind of nervous where I know <laughs> it's going to be quite important to get it right again. Quite nerve-wracking. 49%. Surely this turn, or this turn, this time round. There we go. Siege of Nantes, however you pronounce that, is done. Good job. Hello, Brittany. Okay, yeah. Big victories so far. It's looking good for France. And we're now just sieging out the rest of Brittany. Should we go? I see Castile down there. Hello. I'll I'll leave, I'll leave them be for now. Um, it's only a ten. Yeah, I don't really want to fight them alone. I'm gonna keep my armies together. Seven percent. 
okay, they, these guys can all go fight them. Just go get in their way, go distract them, be annoying. You know, you, you do you. Can I, Aragon, are you still not done? You got Naples back. You know, you didn't get Naples back. How did you mess that up? I have no idea. They, they really screwed that one up. Um, a call to arms. They will not accept. Minus 1,000. They do not want any land. They're just not interested. Fair enough. Come on, 21%. Oh, if we can get this, that would really, really help the Janissaries for the Ottomans. And there we go. 29% war score. I mean, what would I get if I wanted to peace out right now? Like, one, two, three. Just a couple provinces. Could I make them a vassal? That is the all-important question. Because that would be... Actually, no, we don't want that. Let's just take one, two, and three. One, two, three. No. One, two, three. Okay, they won't accept this. Okay, I want more. I'm greedy. We're not We're not going to settle for that. Let's go do some stuff. Let's go win this war properly. Hello, Papal State. You're not involved, are you? You're just... You just happen to be wandering around. Right, that battle's pretty close, so if we just go and spam our troops in there, should be okay. I see the Spain is around, uh, Castile's around too, so we'll see. There's going to be some sort of battle, I imagine, if we just wander around. Here we go. This should trigger it, although I'm not actually sure we'd win that, so I'm kind of nervous. Uh, no, it didn't work. Okay, let's get them. Come on. Okay, yeah, there we go. They got distracted. We did take a crossing penalty, but we got a fire one to cover for it. So we should win this, although they're coming back. Hurry up, hurry up. There we go. We do win the battle. Okay, now if they want to charge into me, they can. But there we go. We won that one. That was pretty good. Get that victory. Nice. Yeah, that was really useful. Sends them packing. Let's get them here. They took a penalty already. Oh, we missed out. And now we've got... No, they took another penalty. But we're still going to lose somehow. Get in their reinforcements. Oh, there's some other reinforcements. There we go. We jumped. That was so close to being a defeat. But we do win another battle. It's so far so good. There we go. Spread out again. Whew. This is tense. But uh, we, yeah, we've, we've got... Came through those battles. Bit of luck. St. Castile running backwards again. Are right, you willing to accept my terms yet? No. Okay, I'm going to try and separate piece Saluzo. Let's go over here. Get rid of them. And that will at least help us out. Increase the war score. Get rid of them. Less numbers. I see there is a bit of a stack down here. It includes Castile, but there you go. Should be able to. 31, 20. We still have an advantage, but obviously all the, all the vassals just wandering around doing their own thing is probably not the best way to do it. Can I? Oh, yeah. Isn't there a way? Create new unit, no. Allow friendly armies to attach. There we go. Allow friendly armies to attach. If anyone wants to come and join, it will be much appreciated. Venice has been excommunicated. Steel, are you going to keep charging? Where are you going? You're, you're walking right next to me. You're getting very brave. I don't know where they went. Uh, I assume they're about to attack them out of nowhere, so I'll just go prepare for that. Someone did come and attach. That, no, that that plan worked out great. I don't think we need to be here. Let's move away. I think it's safe. 7%. They are sieging out some stuff. Okay. Okay, they are actually joining. This is, this is great news. So we will... Let's go see if we can win this at battle. All right, lose 10 loyalty, currently at 50. Gain 10 from 40. Gain legitimacy and... Foiks won't like us. Or well, Foiks will like us. We lose 10. Okay, let's do that one. It's going to be ages before we annex some of these. It doesn't matter too much. All right, here we go. 20 versus 8. We did get a penalty, but hopefully we're fine. Spain actually ran, or Castile just ran into our rebels. So we do pick up another victory. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. This is, this is successful. And Granada having a lot of success back in Castile. And that is Foiks doing their bit down here as well. I thought it, keep thinking it's Aragon. They literally look identical. Just like one extra red line in the flag. Is it in the difference between them? On oh, 21%. Let's get this done. Come on, bit of luck. No, okay. Maybe next time. We'll get them separate pieced. That'll be useful. Nice early victory. We're also 55% of the way towards annexing Orlon. So that'll be useful. 
get that integrated. That'll be five provinces. Get back the one that I gave away by accident. Well, I didn't give it away by accident, but I, I thought it was five years, not ten. So that was my mistake. We'll be getting all those provinces back. Making France bigger. Expanding. Are you willing to accept my terms for peace yet? No. You still won't give me those three provinces. That's very bold of you, Brittany. Um, especially once I separate peace Castile, which is happening. I can feel it. Sue for peace. Uh, you... Gonna be a French vassal. They would be a French vassal. No, I don't have space for that, so I will just take trade power, war reps, and all your money, which is not that much. But there we go. I like how taking all their money was equivalent to killing them, like or not killing them, owning them. Castile, are you you done? Do you want an individual peace deal? You don't. Ooh, bold. Not what I was expecting, but there you go. There we go. We separate piece them, so that's good. That's a little bit less. Some more. Mercenaries, and they will now give us this. Okay, can I have all you? Can I break your alliance? Uh, no. Okay, I want to end their alliance with Castile, so that next time's easier. But it might even be easier to do it the other way around. Make Castile break their alliance with them. It could be the way to go about this. There's so many random stacks of troops. It's just kind of awkward. You're trying to make them walk into each other at random spots. Lose 55 ducats, but gain base tax. Yeah, that's fine. We'll do that. Oh, the Iberian wedding just happened. That's not good. Uh, yeah, that is really bad. Okay, peace deal. <laughs> this is this is done. We don't. You don't need to break that alliance. Uh oh. <laughs> No, no, no. Okay, yeah, fine. We, we, we'll take this. I'm not fighting both of them. Aragon is in. Okay, well, that's really bad. Uh, Castile is now the... Uh, that That is like the worst possible scenario. Okay, that makes things a lot harder. Yeah, I can't fight both of them. That, that's not happening. Not now, anyway. So, yeah, that has to end. War over. We came to a whole one province, but yeah, we can't take that one, I'm afraid. That's way too much. Did I just lose great power status? No, I'm I'm clinging on. Okay, getting a bit nervous. Got to stay on there. Royal marriage with Castile. No, that's not Castile. Uh, you, if we maybe let's improve relations with Castile. <laughs> maybe if an alliance once we've uh, integrated Orleans is on the cards, wouldn't be the worst choice. There you go. You can have access. Let's be friends. Let's flip this on its head. They are way too strong now. Yeah, Aragon was in there. Um, we don't want to deal with that in Navarra as well. I mean, not 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 huge, but every little helps, you know. Every little bit of contribution is is painful for us. But yeah, there we go. I mean, we won. We 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 showed showed our force. But yeah, we need to just back away from that. Sadly, Brittany will remain allied to Castile, which is a bit of an issue. I don't know if I can ever break that alliance. If they will ever accept it. At the moment, that's a pretty big no. But maybe at one point it will be the appropriate. Anyway, 68%. Slowly using six diplomatic power a month, really? We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Estimated to be done in September in two years. Okay, that should be fine. We're out of a war now, so it should speed up, I think. I would guess. <laughs> I'm imagining. I'd, maybe I'm imagining that. Yeah, let's, let's try to be friends with our buddies in the south. I don't want any of their territory, so as long as they leave me alone, I'm happy with that. And yeah, obviously, England is actually the bigger problem. I didn't really want to fight Castile, but yeah, we do need to obviously get Brittany at some point. Maybe ideal world, England kills Brittany, and then I take it back off England kind of thing. <laughs> sort of work, work it out that way. Maybe in the future, we'll see. And obviously Burgundy as well. I want, I'm more worried about those two. If we can avoid them for now. That would be nice. And just, you know, rebuild. Become stronger. Obviously Burgundy can be quite strong if they have they have a lot of junior partners and a vassal. So yeah, we don't want to don't mess with them too much. Until we're ready. Yeah, look at that. Pretty scary. Right, lose 25 admin power. Foix will like us or we could have them dislike us even more and ours goes down. Okay, no, we will help you this time. I didn't last time. This time though, we will be helping. Castile is still struggling here. We'll see with Aragon's help. I'm sure that will be turned around. Although they are up against 
quite the challenge. I mean, there's still a lot in there. The Prussian Confederation seeks Polish support. I have no idea what some of these events mean, but there you go. That happened. Anyone who does know what that means? Is Prussia here? No. Okay, relation improvement with Castile is over. They would accept. Um, obviously, I can't do it right now because I'm at... Oh, no, I'm at 6 out of 7. Don't know what happened. But then somebody disappeared. But yeah, well, I like Castile. They'll probably call me straight into their war, won't they? Just straight out of nowhere. Hopefully not. 81% on that annexation. It's coming along. Oh, Danzig. Are they always at the start? Yeah, they must be. I don't know. There's lots of new nations. Oh, Wallachia just got integrated into Poland. Uh, that's not normal. But yeah, Poland just took all of that over, so that was quick. And obviously they have Moldavia as well, although I think Moldavia is a march. No, they're a vassal. Though, would it say they are a march? Yeah, I think it does. It has the little sword on it. Territory, there we go. What's this? Offaly. Okay, so these guys are getting pretty big. That's kind of cool. In Ireland, I, normally the one that gets big is the one allied to England and Scotland. Yeah, that helps them out quite a bit. There we go, we'll call that province. 84.8%. Come on. You can do this. Just keep on ticking upwards. You're getting it there. You're getting up there. You're getting towards it. And, oh, some rebels have risen up. We'll deal with those. 86%. Nice. We're getting towards... Completion of the first. We should probably start improving relations with the next person we want to integrate. I've started with the big ones. I'm actually going to change my mind. I'm going to do the small ones first from now on. So who or who's got the lead? Actually, Orleans is already up there. 125. These guys are not keen. Armanac, These three provinces. Bourbonnais is two there. Foix is down there at the bottom. Uh, let's go with these Bourbonnais guys. Hello. Place relative, placate, there is a lot of options there I'll deal with in the future. Um, or not in the future, because they'll be disappeared, but... Yeah, let's get these guys. I want to want to remove all this border gore. If we can connect as much of it as possible, and then we'll do the outer ones at the end. Not sure if that's a tactical way, but you know, any strategy is better than no strategy at the end of the day. As long as you have some sort of plan, it can be better. This war is looking really bad for Castile, so... I don't know what's going on. It's also noble rebels, so yeah, this is getting really messed up for them. Obviously didn't help that we were beating them every time. But yeah, I just I didn't want to mess with Aragon at the same time. I had no idea how that would pan out for us. Looks like I made I probably could have kept going. We probably could have actually like brought them to their knees if we kept going by the look of it, but no, it doesn't matter. It's fine. And we'll get military technology level five. Nice four, four, and five. Superior unit types. And war. Oh, Burgundy just declared war on me. Okay, and Castile refusing to help me. Thanks, guys. Obviously expected. Alright, we're outnumbered here, so that's always good. Um, We'll leave this to next episode. But yeah, that'll be it for this one. So as always, if you have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. Be sure to subscribe as well if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you in the next one.